When you wish to address a script on another object, an alternative to using get component is to use send message. Send message is a way of calling a function or method on another object when triggering it in a completely opposite script. So if I want to, in this example, trigger something to happen with the box I have in the foreground by dropping the blue ball onto my red switch, I can use send message. Currently in this example, it just falls on the switch and nothing happens. So the first thing I'm going to do is to write a script. So go to the create button on the project panel and choose JavaScript. Now into this one, I'm going to write a script that I want to call with the switch. So I'm going to call this one reactor. I'm going to edit and into this, I'm simply going to write a function called react with a capital R. So I'm not going to place any arguments into this particular function. Um, so when I call it with send message, I'm just going to say send message and then the name of react. So what do I want to do with this? Well, the first thing I want to do is to, uh, when the switch triggers, I want to change the material uh, to use a different texture than the one on it at the moment. So I'm going to say renderer.material.maintexture is equal to, let's say, down texture. So in my project, I've got block down and block up. And at the moment, it's got this up arrow texture. So I'm going to change it to that. So I'll need to create a variable to refer to that. So I'm going to call that obviously down texture. And the type for texture reference this way is texture 2D capital T and a 2 capital D. So as soon as this function is called, it's going to start using that down texture. So I'm going to assign that block down um, in the inspector in a moment. Then I'll place in a yield to make it um, pause for just a second. Wait for seconds one. And then I'm going to add a rigid body to this particular object. So it's going to change texture, wait a second, and then fall with gravity. So if you save that script, go back to Unity, and drop it onto an object that you want to react. So a block, for example. So this block uh, is going to need the down texture 2D assigning to it. So that is something I'm going to call with my switch. So I then need to write a script that's going to call that function. So I'm going to call a new JavaScript. So create button and then choose JavaScript. And this new switcher script is simply going to have a standard on collision enter and we'll create a variable called col which is of type collision and into that I'm going to say if col dot game object dot name is equal to uh, capital S for switch because that's what I've got in my hierarchy then we're going to do a particular thing so I'll just refer to the object I want to call it on. So game object dot find block capital B, which matches my hierarchy dot send message. So capital S capital M. And then into the argument for that, I'll write the name of the function, not the script, the name of the function I wish to call. So send message is going to look through uh, any scripts on the object I'm referring to and look for this function name. So my function name is react with a capital R. So provided I put into inverted commas react, then it's going to call that function. So I'm going to save that script, return to Unity and apply that to my ball. So the ball is looking for the switch and as soon as it collides with that switch, then it's going to call the react method on my block. So if I press play now, the ball falls down and the function is called straight away. You can see the texture has changed. It waited for a second and then dropped. And there it is one more time. So that's a simple usage of send message in Unity.